Okay guys, as you can see, I'm with Aaron once again and we've discovered an incredible bank of vending machines just here. They're by the side of the road though, so it's a little bit noisy. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab a couple of these drinks and maybe head find over a, a little bit quieter location. A little place to park and yeah. get out of the way. But there's a few, I mean today it's January, right? It's not super cold, but I am kind of interested in trying a few of the hot drinks they have here. So you can see that the red mark are the hot drinks, whereas the stuff with the blue, there we go, zoom in on that, blue that. stuff is the, are the cold drinks. So um, I'm gonna hand the camera over to Aaron and I'm just gonna I choose a few drinks, okay? So I think for starters, we wanna try this uh, yuzu lemon drink. So yuzu is kind of like a citrus fruit. What would you say? It's a cross between a lemon and a grapefruit? Orange. Oh. Or an orange? Or it's like this weird lumpy kind of whatever. It's very pulpy yeah. like an orange. Okay, so let's get it. It's 110 yen. Let's put a thousand yen in. Hopefully they're not sold out of this one. Okay, and here we go. So yeah, that's what a yuzu is. It's, uh, I guess it's that's the yuzu, that's the lemon. If that means anything. But this is definitely nice and warm. Yeah. Okay. So, oh, it didn't give me change. Let's just go and get the next one. You want to get this one? It yeah, says I want to try some Canadian. <laughs> oh, there's, oh, there's our change. change. Yeah, it says it's made with Canadian maple syrup. This is a maple, kind of, it's kind of like a milkshake? I don't know, a milk, it's, uh, it's hot though. Well, I guess let's try it and see exactly what it is. So it's also 110 yen. There we go. It comes in this can. Oh, this is so, just holding these is so nice. I can, I can imagine on a cold winter day, you just buy these to put them in your pocket and keep your hands warm. But, uh, okay, let's get one more. Ooh, what do we got here? So, I'm very interested in this Boss brand. Now, in Japan, Boss is a very famous, like, coffee, canned coffee uh, brand, and I think, Who's the sponsor they usually have in their, their commercials? Tommy Lee Jones. Yes. Is he in the yeah. Boss ones? It's the Boss yes, ones, right? Yes, he's in the Boss ones. Yeah, I don't see his picture here, but quite often you see Tommy Lee Jones. His commercials. Uh, yeah, exactly. With Boss so coffee. I'm not really huge into coffee. This is espresso and cappuccino. However, this is a spicy consomme soup. And this is a corn soup. I also noticed there was a corn soup over there. And I think there's a corn soup up that way. So maybe another day we can come back and compare all the corn soups. So for today, let's grab the spicy consomme soup. And this is also 110 yen. Pretty good deal. So have they all been 110? I think yeah. so. So yeah. Did, oh, did I push the right button? Yeah. Yes, okay. <laughs> so yeah, there we go. Spicy consomme soup. So 110 yen is about a dollar, give or take. Yep. Okay, so let's go and give these a try. The machines are just over there. We just thought it would be a little quieter away from the traffic. So uh, which one do you think we should try first, uh, Aaron? Uh, so I would say the soup would be a good choice to start with. Okay, it's like we're having an actual meal. Yeah. Start with the soup course. Delicious soup using special ideas. ideas from our coffee making. So there's some some words written on there. <laughs> so they've know. taken their coffee design, like how they make coffee, and somehow came up with like, you know what, this would be really good making soup. I guess, I don't know. But uh, I'm gonna give it a little shake. I'm, I'm sure it's not gonna explode. This was definitely <laughs> the hottest of the three. Those two came out of one machine, this came out of another machine, and this is definitely hotter. So let's crack this open. There we go. You got your cup yep. there. Let's pour some in Let's here. Let's pour some in. Are we on camera? Get it right up there. I... Oh. You're like, stop, 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 okay. stop, okay. stop, stop. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I don't know if the chunky bits are at the bottom, but here, have some more. <laughs> okay. So there we go. That is the spicy consomme soup. I'm not sure what color that is. Sort of an off, a dirty orange maybe? Yeah, or, or all right. Yeah. 
we'll see. Ooh, it has a really weird smell, doesn't it? Yeah. A yes, it does. A I... savory, it's kind of like the drippings from like a roast beef uh, Ooh, or, that... or something, you know what I'm well saying? Well said, yes. Yeah, or something. When you cook some meat, it's just the smell of that roasted kind of thing. But yeah. Cheers. Uh, this is... <laughs> I, I have no words right now. It's yeah. like, what do I even say to this? Okay, well, this is the first course, so. Eh, bottoms up. Here we go. Here we go. Hmm. That's actually pretty good. I mean, it's a consomme soup. It said yeah. it was spicy, but. I wonder if that's just because they put some, like, a little bit of pepper in it or something. something. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Wow. Would you imagine, like, if you cooked a can of Campbell's, say, vegetable soup, mm -hmm. but you got rid of all the chunks of everything and just ate, the, drank the broth? It would be kind of like that. This is a little better than than. This is that. more of a beef broth. Yeah, it's 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 along those lines, though. Right? Mm. It's not creamy, but it's not like just water either. Yeah, I kind of like this. Of all the drinks, the hot drinks I've had out of vending machines this has got to be up there okay top three for sure yeah so you would definitely get this again sometime yeah i would i'm on That's the pretty maybe good. pretty good i would probably want to try something new true but this yeah. isn't bad so let's uh yeah the sun's really bright right now but let, <laughs> it looks sparkling yuzu lemon ah. okay it looks so here good. we go I do like yuzu, so I'm very excited to try this. Hmm, yeah. Good? You got it? Oh, that's really good. Yeah, there's my glass. That's there a good is. smell. Yeah, it's good. This is a drink that makes you feel like if you have a cold or something, it's going to be like vitamin C kind of okay. type thing, you know? That's my impression just from the smell. It looks like lemonade. Yeah. Good stuff. All right, so yeah, I don't know if you can see there's like steam coming off that. It's definitely warm. So let's have a cheers. Hi. Oh wait, let's let's do one more special shout out to three more of my Patreons. Um, I just want to say thanks to everybody who's watching my videos and especially to my patrons who support the channel. And in particular, three more. Oh, okay, there's a guy <laughs> clearing away the carts there. In particular, three more are Jackie Hero, uh, Sumo Rat, and, and Seth. Seth Gover. So yes. thanks to you three for your support and come, come by. by. Here we go. That's a that, sweet hot lemonade. Yeah. Yeah. It's not. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say it's not sour like a lemon, but you no. just said it was sweet, and it is. It's a little off. It's not quite a lemon, but it's very citrusy. It's good. I like it. Yeah. Um, and you're right. This is like a you got a cold. You need some vitamin C kind mm -hmm. of drink. Hot. And good winter drink. And I think in Japan it is common to have a yuzu kind of tea, especially in the winter time. Mm -hmm. Maybe yuzu and honey. Is that something? Yeah. Yeah, honey and ginger. All uh, right, ginger. And then, yeah, yuzu and honey mm -hmm. as well. This is yeah, good. this is pretty good. If you ever get a chance, you should try. Does it actually have any juice in it at all? Yay! 1%? 1% juice, yay! <laughs> of course. Of course. Okay, let's get into, I guess this would be dessert? Yeah, what we got here is a maple milkshake. <laughs> And it says it's made with Canadian maple syrup, so yay. That, there you go. Maple milkshake, that's interesting. This could be a thick one. It is warm though, like. I hope so. It's not, like a milkshake should be cold, really, mm -hmm. but. That's nice and creamy. You see that? Yeah, it kind of looks, looks like. like a coffee. Yeah, it looks like a cafe latte coming mm -hmm. out of a can there. Does it have a coffee? Doesn't smell like a coffee. No? It smells like maple syrup. <laughs> All right, it, let's just yeah, put this put back up aside. here. It's not as thick as I was expecting it to be. Oh, wow. Right? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so there is a lot of maple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Ready? <laughs> cheers. Yeah, cheers. All right. 
Bottoms up. Mmm. Wow. It's actually not bad. So this kind of tastes like a, a maple pudding. Pudding, yeah, I was gonna say. It's like a pudding. It tastes like a maple pudding. I thought there would be like chunks in it though. Unless they're all at the bottom. No? Hard to say. I guess there's one way to find out, right? Oh. Is there a chunk? Uh, I don't know or if that was just a chunk. Bubbles? That was just a bubble, yeah. So yeah, that's it. Nothing at the bottom. But this yeah, that's, I like it. I think, I'm surprised, but everything we actually chose is pretty good. Does this bring you any memories of home? No. No? <laughs> no maple? No. <laughs> maple pudding it's, is what it tastes like. Right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, it kind of does for me. Mm -hmm. As a kid, I used to eat like a butterscotch puddings or... Ah. Um, I mean, your yeah. choco chocolate. And yeah, stuff. I was gonna say I I always prefer, you know, chocolate or banana or something over mm. caramel. This this kind of gives me a similar taste to uh, like a butterscotch pudding. Mm. It's not butterscotch; it's maple. Mm. But well, this one's cooled down a bit, but they're all warm, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, cold winter day. You're driving for a little while, and you want to, you know, take yeah. a little pit stop. For check sure. out some vending machines here in Japan. So yeah. 110 yen for any of these. I think that's a pretty good yeah. deal. And like you said, yeah, it's cold. Grab grab the drink. And I like to uh, <laughs> suck the heat out of it in my hands to keep warm <laughs> and then drink it. But yeah, it's great. You can also get warm drinks at convenience stores too. When you yeah. go up to the till, there's usually a section of hot drinks. Yeah, it's not I a very don't know big if, one. But... Yeah, I don't know if they have this kind of thing, mostly coffees or maybe green tea. Green tea's and... hot. I've seen it. They might have hot. like a yuzu one there too. But yeah, so that's it for this video. What do you yeah. say? There's a lot there. I think we should come back sometime and try some of the other things that we didn't get a chance to. What do you say? Yeah, I, I saw some interesting things. Yeah. Like you said, there's the corn soups and there's all other kinds of things that we didn't really get a chance to try yet. Right. So maybe I have to take another road trip back this way. Yeah, let's do it. So thanks for watching everybody and thanks to Aaron for joining us. Um, I'll put a link down in the description. You can check out his Instagram account. Yep. Um, he doesn't have a YouTube channel. Not yet, but yet. I'm, I'm gonna try to work on getting one started. So. Okay, we'll see I'll, what happens. I'll, I'll keep, update you. I'll keep them updated about that. So thanks a lot guys, and we'll catch you guys in the next video.